Now they'll have to pair off because now the white flag's in the wind. There's just one lap to go. And Bobby Labonte has caught them. He came from way back in the last two laps. He gets up on Dale Jarrett's back bumper. Our Circuit City onboard camera rides with Bobby Labonte as he closes. Up on Dale Jarrett. Now there's Schrader, the yellow car to the inside. Boy, oh boy, I tell you what, this back straightaway, as they go down the back straightaway, they're heading that way. Here comes Gordon on the inside. Jeff Gordon in the slipstream of Sterling Marlin, and up the outside comes Dale Jarrett. Oh, they made, they touched on the back straightaway, Marlin on, in the middle there, and here comes the 88 car, Dale Jarrett. And the 28 of Ricky Rudd comes low, trying to sniff a draft off of Gordon. Jarrett to the outside. All that skirmishing left a clear path for Jarrett on the outside. Oh, trouble! Right in the wall, hard. Schrader in the wall, hard. Jarrett the winner. Gordon second. And Rudd on his roof for the second time in the Bud shootout. Reminiscent of 1984 when his car tumbled in the air. It'll be a lap to go. Here comes and the 11. Earnhardt Nation up front. Here they come, boys. White flag. One lap to go. Yippee! This is all right. I love it. It's the bell lap. And they're three, almost four wide in the back. Three by one there, side by side behind them still. Stewart almost. in second, looking back from Earnhardt. Almost every position changed places as they came to the white flag. Junebug's been getting off a two real nice. If he protects the bottom... Little blocking if he goes down the back. One back there, 48's got a big Johnson run here behind coming him. on the outside with Sorensen and Mears. Watch that outside, watch the outside, protect the bottom. Now is that yellow line your best friend? It is now, it is now. Because you can't pass below it, but that outside line, they're getting a run. Here comes Johnson to the high side. And Earnhardt comes up to block. That opens the bottom for Stewart. And the 30th Budweiser shootout goes to the Amp National Guard and Pala, Dale Earnhardt Jr. Yes, sir. All right. All right. Bank it, baby. Bank it. Strap down this big TV. She's going to go for a ride. Here we come. White flag. Bail out. One to go. Woohoo. Stewart's got, the, Stewart's got a great car, no question about that. It's just a matter of if uh, Kirk can get a little help. And now, Ryan jumped to the high side. Tony Stewart blocks him. Here comes Kyle Busch on the bottom. Uh-oh, Toyota drag race okay. down the back. Toyota drag race. Teammates. Newman was trying to get help from the other blue Dodge. Now he's got it. Toyota on the inside lane. Dodge on the outside lane. Who's going to win it? It's going to come all the way to the wire. Here they go into turn three. Teammates working together. 2018, 212. 12 is going to win this race. I don't believe they can catch him back to the line. He's going to have to make it wide. Pedal, baby. Pedal. He's have to make it wide. Pedal. It's the Boilermaker, Ryan Newman. Ryan Newman, Roger Penske wow. win the Daytona 500. Way to go, guys. Way to go. Roger Penske's wow. first restrictor plate win and his first one two finish. And Bottom, you'll be okay, I think. But Darrell's been turned two. That's where the strength has been with this 48 car. Kyle Busch poised to take advantage. It's a three-car race with a mile outside. to go. He's looking outside. You better block him if you want to hold him off. Got a good run. Kenthis pulls the block, going off into turn three. Johnson goes to the high side. He's he going to try to get that momentum. Jimmy Johnson won one last Jimmy year like this. Race. Kenseth with the edge, here comes Johnson, Jimmy's momentum got it. outside. He's got it, he's got it, he's got it. Johnson, 48, yeah. wins the UAW Daimler Chrysler Woo. 400. He led one lap. Down in turn one and two. Teammates last year, rivals this year. Friends, maybe never. To but Joey bottom. Logano and Denny Hamlet are going to settle this right now. Oh, Hamlin, Joey got loose. He got a little sideways Look off the ball. There you go. Hamlin gave him a shot. One to go. Outside, barely. Outside. Hamlin there. Logano to the bottom, trying to hold his ground. That's going to be tough, though. But, but he, he's been running good on the bottom. If he could just clear Hamlin right there. No way. He's going to lose his momentum. They're going to touch hard. Are they going to make it? Neck and neck. Got down the back. Side by side. Here. Kyle Busch plays again. Watch out for that third place car, Kyle Busch. He's looking. Hamlin edges ahead. They get it. They touch. They touch. Here comes Kyle. Hamlin got on the ball. Hamlin spins down the racetrack. And Kyle Busch wins in California. I thought they'd be nice to each other.
each other? They weren't. You don't suppose he's singing back home again in Indiana, do you? Jeff Gordon off turn four. He's just got the one turn to negotiate, to fight off everybody. The crowd roaring. They're on the feet to call the finish of the Rickyard 400. Here's Mike Doy. Brett Bodine closes in, but the youngest driver in the field shall lead them home. Jeff Gordon of Pittsburgh, Indiana, upholds the honor of the Hoosier State and wins the inaugural Brickyard 400 for his second career Winston Cup victory. He's going to come down the last lap. He stretched this field like a big rubber band, and it's got to snap back together again, and that's just what it's doing. White flag, one lap to go. He's going to get a shot at him. Kyle Petty is there. He is just a car length back of Earnhardt. Baby Allison coming up, but I don't think will be a factor. Okay. Kyle just hauls it off the corner. He's got the inside. I'll tell you what. He's up to Earnhardt's oh. bumper. Earnhardt oh, takes it. They're on the, the racing service down on the uh -oh. left part of the racetrack. And, oh, 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 oh. and it's Kyle Petty. Kyle Petty coming to the checkered flag. Here comes Davey Allison to the bottom. It'll be the finish. Everybody oh, was oh, waiting for it. Oh, they we crashed can. past the finish line. Uh -oh. They have crashed into turn number one. And Davey Allison is in a shower of sparks. He won the race, but he sure paid the price for it. Now, Dale Jr. becomes the Department of Defense. But you watch him, Daryl. I bet he'll hug that yellow line. He don't want to open up the bottom. NASCAR has called Junior's pass a clean pass. This is for the win. Can he do it, guys? It'd be four in a row. He has about a fourth of a lap to go. Remember, the start finish line is way down headed into turn one. It's not in the center of the trial. You can't do it, Larry. You can't make it. You can't get, you're not going to pull out and pass him with a single foul. <laughs> White flag for Kenny Brack. Davey's right there. I mean, you know, we're talking a, a half a dozen car lengths. Davey Hamilton, after four third place finishes, looking for his career best in the Cup Boys Indy Racing League tonight. There he is in second place. And out of turn four, driving the A.J. Boyd's power team car, the first driver to win three Pep Boys IRL races in a row. Kenny Brack takes the checkered flag. For third place to the line, Eddie Cheever off pace by five miles an hour, but he's going to hold off Scott Goodyear. They'll be coming to the white flag this time. The Rouseketeers, one, two, three, then Buddy Rice, Scott Pruitt, and Martin Truex. Martin is there. And One to go. Too white close. flag. You tell me who led it. I have no idea. Too Martin, close to call. Martin led it. Bush with a little advantage, half a car like Mark Martin charges back. back. Maybe he's charging back. This just looks just like the last lap. Who's going to get the best run through three and four? Coming to take the checker flag. Looks like Mark's, Mark's trying to hold him down. him down. He's pinning him down. Mark, Mark, Mark. 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 Whoa. Now on our electronic scoring, we have the time to the thousandth of a second, the difference that they crossed the line, and the difference is point zero zero. Zero. I don't think I've ever seen that before. Two, We've seen some close ones. Two laps in a row. Less than a thousandth of a second separated them. You want equal? How equal can it get? Call it, Larry. Boy. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's it close. It's close. Right there, it, it looked like the six car by just a little bit. Fly ball, left field. Caught! Bottom Fishers no more. The Rays are going to the playoffs. Flag this time by. They have eight seconds. Back to the third place car, Terry Labonte, and Labonte may lose third before it's over. Cale Yarbrough is closing in on Labonte. Turn one for the final time. Walter will climb up the racetrack. Gant has the short way around on the bottom side. Walter points it down the back straightaway at Richard Petty's STP Pontiac. That will be a lap down if they catch him. Don't think they will. They go into turn three. Has Harry Gant got anything left? 
Darrell seems to have something left. And unless such Harry does something spectacular, his car, Harry's car got a little loose off that corner. Darrell's going to come across the line here winning. Darrell Waltrip, a hand in the air, a wave to the crowd of 100,000 plus. He wins $200,000. He blows up. Going in the first corner, he blew up. What a Hollywood ending. Oh, I tell you what, Junior Johnson will be glad to throw that in the garbage can. Right on this back bumper as they come off turn four, they, he started to put a move on him. White flag. Two and a half miles to history. Jeff Gordon trying to win his second. Dale Earnhardt trying to win his second. Buddy, where will Earnhardt make the move? Well, I don't know. Gordon looks awful strong as they come off turn two over there down the back straightaway. Kenny Irwin looks to the outside. Right here is where he has to make, make the move. And he wasn't able to get that run up under Jeff Gordon like he wanted to. But that's what we said Friday. He was this far behind in the International Race of Champions. He, he looks inside. He goes outside. He looks inside again. Okay, right now, he's got to pull right down on that back bumper and try to get him loose coming off turn four. He does not have the muscle at this point. But he may have some momentum. Here comes Earnhardt. He's all the way to the bottom, almost in the grass. He slides up the racetrack, and Jeff Gordon will win it for the second time. Wow. What a race. He's going to wait on this. He's going to put the crossover on it. He realized that wasn't a good move that last time. White flag. Here he goes. He's going to try to slide under him here. Come on, baby. And Blaney's coming. He both these cars are driving terrible right now. Not nah. left to go. Nah, they're driving good. Come on, baby. You can do it on this end of the speedway. Come off the board and get up alongside of him. Half a mile Here he gone. comes. Here he comes. Who's going to get off? Here he comes. Here he comes. He's got him this time. It's going to be a drag race. Whoa! They touch. They touch. Craven got him. Craven got him. Craven got him. And Craven. Johnson looked high, Kenseth to drag right, with Edwards, to Johnson to the bottom, to the top. Right, Matt, Man, Matt got shuffled out again. Jimmy Johnson with Carl Edwards, but Kenseth up the middle, coming back, help from David Reagan, up to the bumper of Carl Edwards, Reagan in the middle, his teammate Gilliland is the, the pusher, they're Bill right on the bumper of Edwards, four, is there, there anywhere to go, Reagan, Reagan to the bottom, the Reagan. Gilliland with him. David Reagan, July winner at Daytona a couple of years ago. Gilliland with him. Edwards up top. Michael Waltrip to help. And here they come off turn four. Push, boys, push. Push hard. Edwards high. Reagan comes up. Come on his block. Gilliland, Reagan, got Gilliland. it. He's got it. Front row racing in victory lane at Talladega. Reagan first. Gilliland second. What an unbelievable run there. Not a first-time winner, but a first-time Talladega winner. Look at those teammates. No, but this team, this team. Got to run, got to run. He's looking, he's looking. Down to the inside comes Logano. Gordon leads at the line. Logano into turn one, takes it back. Yep, those four tires against two. That's pretty hard to overcome. They've got a gap on Vickers. Biffle, Biffle racing for third. Then Kyle Busch. Here comes Kyle oh, Larson. Boy. Oh, boy. Here we go. Into turn three. Three wide. And Larson on the bottom chasing Kyle Busch. It's the Kyle and Kyle show behind Logano and Gordon. Connecticut. Go Huskies. Joey Logano wins. <laughs> the 500 showing his muscle now. Three makes in the 500, Chevy, Pontiac, Ford, that's how they run. But Earnhardt has a benefit, there's a slow car up ahead. And there's he trouble coming off a of turn two, some cars get strangled, it might be this. Whoever gets back to the start-finish line, they'll get the white and the yellow together. Lake Speed and John Andretti tangle as the leaders head for turn number three. Andretti and Spencer got together. This could be the Daytona 500, Bobby Labonte goes to the outside. Labonte up high, Earnhardt uses the left car of Rick Bass to the, as a pick. 20 years of trying, 20 years of frustration. Dale Earnhardt will come to the caution flag to win the Daytona 500. Finally, the most anticipated moment in racing. 
If John Elway can win the Super Bowl, Dale Earnhardt said he could win the Daytona 500. And if he comes around under caution to complete this final lap, the taste of long-awaited victory will be his. This looks dead even. Yep, he did not jump him now. If something happens to Gordon now and, and Darrell gets ahead of him, so be it. Where will Earnhardt go? That may decide who has the lead coming out of turn two. Look at DW. He's actually, he's got a half a car length on Gordon. As they come off turn two, Gordon pulls back. Uh -huh. so he's got a strong car. Here comes the old gray mare on the inside. It's Earnhardt all the way to the bottom. Oh, and he gets goodness. away with it. Great Hard move. Hard start, start beating. He's still got to go by a... Oh, no, no, no way. Oh, man. There's a bunch of cars in trouble. Bobby Labonte hits right at the flag stand. So does Lake Speed. There are five, make that four, trashed race cars. Dale Jr. pushing Cliff Boyer. Where'd Junebug come from? This will be the white flag. We're Jamie going. McMurray is in front to try to win the 500. This will be the last lap. Whatever happens now happens, folks. They can all walk. Biffles Whoa. all over the back of it. Edwards looks Whoa. in the middle. Whoa, I think That'll hurt Harvick. Harvick. Might have been Harvey. Kind of gone to the outside and gone with that fast line. Here comes Truex fighting his way back on, on the outside in that 56, but not a lot of help out there. Three wide. Here comes Dale Jr. pushing Cliff Boyer. Where'd Junebug come Just from? Marks. This will be the white flag. We're Jamie going. McMurray is in front to try to win the 500. This will be the last lap. Whatever happens now happens, folks. They can all wad up down here, and somebody's going to leave out that turn, second turn to winner. Junior on the bottom with Boyer. Biffle Truex. ahead. Truex trying to get up there and help McMurray, but Boyer's right there behind Biffle in the 16. Look at, there goes Boyer look to at, the outside. Look at Junior. Come on, Junior. Come on. Can they make it to the flag? Nah, no way. They'll never get through this third turn. Junior got squirreled up right there. Nah, it's just perfect. He's flying through there. Dale Earnhardt Jr. unbelievably has caught Jamie McMurray as they come to turn four. He'll have to go to the high side, though. McMurray will guard that line. Yep, Crash Gordon. at the back, never mind. Green flag still out. Checkered flag in the air. The 52nd Daytona 500 Murray. to Jamie yes. McMurray. Yes, little Jamie baby. Woo! Hook, line, and sinker. Yes, sir. If he's going to go. Full single file. White flag, one lap to go. To the white man. Behind him. Five, Front six, four, eight, single eight. foul. Here they go. They got to go. They got to get Mark. Move. They got to move him somehow. He gets back to that yellow line right around the bottom, all the way through turn one and two. Mark single Martin foul. is driving the race of his life, and there's nobody that's better at holding people off at Daytona. And Kyle Busch lagged back a little bit. Is he going to get help? Is he going to come? He's looking. Back behind you. Almost, he almost squeezed Harvick into the wall, and here comes Harvick, the 29, Coming with Matt outside. Kenseth. Oh, Mark Coming got outside. loose. Watch Mark got loose. And down. Harvick's getting a run off turn four. It's going to be a drag race all the way back to the start-finish line. No caution. They're side by side, right Mark. to the line. Big crash. Here they come. Checkered flag. Harvick. Harvick. Kevin Harvick wins the Daytona 500. We got one car. And there's still oh, Ruth coming across the start. They're like still wrecking. Warrior. They're wrecking everywhere. Watching him, watching the flag man. No sign of yellow. Bush has the lead. Boyer wants it. Here comes Benson. They are almost three wide as they come off the corner. No caution. Here come the leaders. Boyer holds it. Bush is right with them. Four cars under a blanket. Two by two with two to go. And, and Yaley is off the racetrack. He's out of harm's way. Here they come, and Kyle Busch is going to try to hold them off. Boyer tap. Oh, they're sideways. Look at Robbie Gordon on the high side. He gets all four cars, all the leaders. Caution comes out as Michael Waltrip makes the pass. Now remember, the field was frozen when the caution came out, but the cars that caused the caution, they are not able to stay on the lead lap or get the free pass. Larry, as I saw it looking across the track at the moment, the starter lifted the caution flag. Michael Waltrip had passed those cars to take the lead. And a fellow who was down in the mouth all weekend about his Bush program just not coming together is probably going to go to victory lane. They are still crashing down the front straightaway.